Hello friends. I hope all of you are good. This is a new series where we are going to understand about the new 7 QC tools. The new 7 QC tools or N7, they are also called as 7 management and planning tools. In 1977, the Japanese Union of Scientists and Engineers, JUSE, they developed these tools. The intent was to develop mechanisms to capture and analyze non-numerical and verbal data set. In this video, we shall introduce new 7 QC tools and discuss their major differences with the basic 7 QC tools. The committee of JUSE developed these tools to work in conjunction with basic 7 QC tools. Generally in board meetings, in various formal and informal discussions, people get some good ideas, suggestions, but unfortunately they are rarely captured. Moreover, during planning and strategizing, majority of these ideas which are discussed, they are generally non-numeric in nature. The new 7 QC tools they help in analyzing such type of ideas and data sets and further they help in strategizing them at first let us see the difference between the new 7 QC tools and the old or the basic 7 QC tools basic 7 QC tools are effective for numerical data processing process control process analysis quality improvement whereas new 7 QC tools they help in organizing verbal data initiate planning strategizing and problem management on one hand basic 7 qc tools they'll help you in database selection of the problem defining them even measuring them measuring the problem along with the improvement on the other hand the new 7 qc tools they are going to help you in planning the actions for the implementation they will help you in generating the ideas cohesive the te cohesive team operations problem definition and even they can help you in the yy analysis as you already know the basic 7 qc tools are check sheet cause and effect diagram stratification pareto chart histogram scatter plot or scatter chart and control chart whereas the new 7 qc tools they are affinity diagram relationship diagram arrow diagram tree diagram matrix diagram matrix data analysis and process decision program chart that's it for now that's it for this video in the next set of videos we shall discuss about each of these new 7 qc tools do not forget to like this video and subscribe our channel feel free to give your feedback and suggestions in the comment box below thank you